welcome back to my channel. For today's video, we are going to be unboxing my BoxyCharm base box for April 2022. The theme this month is Boxy Spring Reveal. So I'm excited for spring. I hope you guys are as well. I can't wait. Well, it's been kind of warm, hot weather here, but I can't wait for more flowers to bloom and to see more nature and for the weather to get a little bit nicer. Also, if you guys are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button. It helps me a ton. So just to share with you guys, honestly, I have not been feeling the greatest the past few days, so I don't really want to do too much of a try on today. I'm going to save that video for later this week. So I'm going to be doing an unboxing with you guys today, showing you guys the products and I can do a few like swatches and stuff, but I'm just not feeling up for the full try on today. I'm going to go ahead and get started with what would have been the choice item. It came wrapped so it doesn't break. This is from Beauty Bakery and this is the Sour You Do in Eyeshadow Palette. These shades will make your eyes squint and then light up in surprise. Rich and bold, yet soft for those who want to be subtle. Sour You Doin' is perfect for spring looks, date night, or maybe even a holiday mixer. Ooh, this palette's really pretty. This is really cute. I love the design with the lemons on it. And then here are the shades. I feel like this palette looks really, really pretty in person. We can do a few swatches. I wasn't expecting one of them to look kind of holographic. That's really pretty. And then the gold is really, really nice. This is the Sangria. It's a really pretty iridescent, like holographic-y look. We have the gold in the shade Icy. This is extremely pigmented. I really like that. And then we'll do the Pink Lemonade, which is a little bit more orangey. So the mattes have a little bit less pigment, but they're still buttery. And then let's do the Refresher, which is like a coppery color. Ooh, that's really pretty. I like that one a lot. I'm really impressed with this palette. I wasn't expecting the quality to be this good, to be completely honest. It is definitely a nice palette. If you guys get this palette, I feel like it's good for everyday wear. Great colors for spring and summer coming up. And again, like I said, the quality seems to be really nice. The gold shade that I did swatch before is actually flaking a little bit. So I guess just make sure to blend them out so you don't have any extra that can fall off throughout the day. This palette retails for $38 and it is also a new launch. I'm actually a really big fan of this. I think this palette is beautiful. And I hope you guys feel the same way. I'm definitely impressed by it. Next product we've got is from Persona and this is their 24 hour waterproof eyeliner in black. Intensify your eyes with this creamy 24 hour waterproof eyeliner that glides on smooth for all day and all night wear. Featuring a smooth blendable formula, this 24 hour waterproof eyeliner is ideal for both the lash line and the waterline and it retails for $14. I don't know about you guys, but I feel like I've gotten this product before, but it may have actually been a lip liner from Persona. I don't know, I don't remember, but I know I remember getting this in a bag, which I've gotten once or twice before. So I don't know if I have this eyeliner or not. I also do have a ton of eyeliners, guys, so I'm not gonna open this to swatch because I think I'm gonna keep it for a giveaway just because I have so many that I don't really need it, so I'm gonna keep that one packaged up. The next product we've got is by Pure Heels. This is their Real Rose Petal Sleeping Mask. This sleep mask contains real rose petals and rose water to moisturize and revitalize your dry and stressed skin while sleeping. When rolling it on the skin, it delivers roses vital moisturizing energy to the skin with a melting technology of rose petals, and it retails for $55. This sounds really expensive. <laughs> I don't know if you guys are able to see it on camera, but there are little rose petals inside of the mask. There's actually quite a lot. It definitely looks like a really moisturizing mask. I'm not sure if I'm gonna like this one or not. We'll try this out eventually, but I don't like the smell of rose in cosmetics for some reason. I like real roses, but I just don't like it in cosmetics. I don't know. I'm just not a big fan of a rose scent unless it's the real thing. Definitely a nice expensive product and hopefully it works. We have next by Christoph Robin. This is their instant volumizing leave-in mist along with rose water. So lots of rose in this box today. Today's video shout out word is rose. If you comment rose down below in the comments first, you'll get a shout out in my next video. This mist makes thin, fine, or flat hair feel thicker and full of body while delivering an easy to style hold. Using a delicate rose blend infused formula with baobab leaf extract and oligo elements from seawater, this mist helps enhance hair 
pears texture and provide a lift at the roots for a long lasting volumized look and it retails for $39. I actually got this last month or the month before in my premium box i think it was last month so i have two of these now i haven't tried the other one that i received only because my hair has just been crazy like poofed out ever since i moved to florida it's like the frizz and the volume it's just like out of this world and i'm just so not used to it right now so i'm still getting used to that so i haven't really had a need for this product but i'll try it out eventually and then the last product we've got in this box is from item beauty i actually haven't tried any item beauty products besides a lip oil that i just got from them this is their lash snack lengthening mascara this flake free and smudge proof lengthening mascara is packed with nourishing lash boosting hydrating conditioners like castor seed oil glycerin and coconut oil so your lashes can live large the unique micro wand and exclusive complex in the formula naturally enhances every single lash for three times the volume and it retails for $15 pretty inexpensive their packaging is cool and makes it easy to open up and it says a dose of self-love i like that i haven't seen this before i didn't know it was silvery inside that's nice this is the mascara it definitely looks really nice and sleek for some reason i don't know if it's just me i feel like it's kind of a little bit misplaced with the silver and then the matte top but i mean it's pretty so we'll try this out soon let me show you guys the brush i'm gonna use these products later this week to do a look i'm just i'm not feeling up to it today what did you guys get in your base boxes if you guys have received it yet let me know down below if not what are you guys hoping to get the total retail value of this box is 161 dollars so it definitely has a great value i believe it's about 28 dollars a month overall i think this was a great box was this box for me maybe not so much for me i love the eyeshadow palette but i do already have some of these products and and I'm just not the biggest fan of rose scented stuff but all in all you know we got an eyeliner a mascara skincare hair care and eyeshadow so it did hit a good amount of the marks this month for this variation specifically and this is the variation c2204014-ba let me know what you guys thought of this box down below today's video shout out goes out to Anna Thank you so much for watching my videos. If you guys want a shout out in my videos, make sure to watch the entire video and look out for the shout out word. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys haven't, make sure to subscribe, hit that like button and turn your post notification bell on so you guys are updated every time I post a new video. Love you guys. Bye.